apologize. We're a little late getting over here. Softball running a bit long, even with the early start. Raiders getting the win 7-1 over Lakeland. Riley Harabi throwing a one hitter, that one hit being a home run, but that was all they gave up as the Raiders get a big conference win. As that one's going to go out of play, that's going to be out for a throw to the Raiders. Medford and Shano. Or excuse me, that's going to be a throw to Shano here early going in the first. Comes in. They're going to play that one from the backside. They are going to not be able to keep that one in. That's going to go out the back for a goal kick. Still trying to get everything set up here. A few things yet to... There we go. Get the audio up there a little bit better for everyone. So that one gets sent downfield. I'm still getting settled in and switching modes from... from Soccer to, or from softball to soccer, we're going to do this all over again tomorrow, weather permitting. We have baseball at 5, soccer following immediately up after that. Throw to the Raiders. That one's going to go all the way downfield. It's just going to keep rolling, keep rolling, keep rolling, keep rolling. It's not going to get far enough. Toronto's going to have to play it. They'll play that one back out here, and Medford will spin around that one, and they'll keep moving in the wrong direction, but... They will settle in now and give that one right back to Sean O'Shaughnell will boom that one downfield. That one's going to bounce back to Medford. Medford, little little run in right there, and Sean going to come away with it. Sean looking to charge downfield. They're going to send that one down the near side. Giving chase. That one is going to bounce around and be kept in play by Medford. Sean will pick it back up. Battle now down in the corner. That one's going to turn around, and that's going to be out for a goal kick. Sun setting here. We're not dealing quite with as much as we were during the softball game. Actually had to run to Walmart and grab a tarp quick to get a little shade for the computer that was overheating in the sun a little bit over there at the softball field, but... Not going to have that problem tomorrow. Pines comes to town for soccer. That is going to be cold. It's going to be rainy. It's going to be just an awful night. Is that one's going to just get tipped? Medford bombing that one downfield. Only white jerseys there from Shano. Shano giving chase. They will send that one over off the far side. That's going to be battled for. It'll be picked up there by Shano. Shano looking to attack the other way. Shano in the black shorts with the white shirts. Medford in all red here today. That one battle for it there. Medford will win it for the moment. Medford trying to send that one down the far side. Looking to build something up. Can't quite get it past the defender. Hard to see numbers on that far side of the field. That's going to swing back out. Shano trying to attack quickly, but they are also giving the ball up rather quickly as well at the midfield. If that one's going to come back around. It's going to be bombed in. Takes a tip. Flag is down, but they can't quite get the shot in. Good recovery there by, I believe that is number four, Madison Miller for Shano. Able to force enough of a problem, and now that ball is going to come all the way back out to midfield. Raiders are going to have to reestablish. This one swings back around. The Hawks pick it up. That's 12. Arcia Preston. Didn't get a chance to talk about names, so we'll do our best as this one's going to swing all the way around down here to the near side. Cross that one into the box. That's going to be fielded by Brunner. <laughs> Brunner goes down for that one. Had to move the camera so I could check and make sure the everything was actually plugged in. We got down here. We got set up and live. We missed all of a minute of this one. Got here at 648. So that one bouncing around through. That's going to get tipped around. They're going to push this one back the other way. That one's going to tip over here. Medford attacking down along this near sideline. That ball's going to spin forward. Picked up there by Tessman. Swing that one all the way back around. We'll talk more about both teams at halftime, or after the half, when I get a chance to flip through all my notes. 
Didn't plan on it being that tight as we get a whistle and a foul. It's going to be a free kick to Shano. Didn't plan on it being that tight. It was a 4.30 start for softball. And with the two pitchers Medford and Lakeland have, expecting a quick game, but it was not. Medford, 7-1 winners over Lakeland. As they even up the conference record. Swing that one in. That's going to be a high bomb. Raiders are going to send that one back out. Right onto the foot of Shayla Radlinger. Defense collapses in around her. Tries to push it off to the far side. White jersey's there. They'll send it back across midfield for the moment. Shano trying to build the attack. They're building on the outside. Shut down by the Raiders. Again shut down by Medford. Medford will send that one back towards the midfield. That one's going to swing back around. Battled for, and that's going to go out of play. Throw to Shano. And we'll get our first substitutions. Your substitution. 7.40 into this one. Conference game tomorrow, and then a swap. Originally on the schedule, Rhinelander was supposed to come here on Thursday, and then now that one has been switched out as that one's going to sneak through, but Brunner's there. Pop that one forward. Brunner there to clean it up. Rhinelander was supposed to come here Thursday. That now has been moved to Rhinelander. Three bodies all going up for the head there, so... Uh, we will not have that one Thursday, but we will have the game tomorrow. That sneak that one in. That one's going to hit ahead. That's going to go out the back. We're going to see. I believe that is. Yes, it is. It's going to be a corner. Corner to the Shawano Hawks. Shawano will set that one up from the far side. Hand is up. It is swung in. And runs into a Raider body, and that will be popped up into the air. Shauna will collect it up on that far side, but it'll be knocked away. I think Medford thought that one was coming through. That's going to come all the way around. That's going to get bounced around. Ball still loose. That one's going to get sent over the bar. Had a chance there in the middle, did Shauna, but sends it over the bar, and that'll be out the back for a goal kick. So we've already passed nine minutes in this one. Big, deep goal kick. That'll be picked up by Shano, though. Shano looking to attack again. Raiders can't quite get it clear as it bounces off a couple bodies. That one's going to come all the way out. It's going to be swung all the way back in. That one's going to bounce high into the air. Radlinger trying to settle under it. Instead, it'll be headed forward by Shano. Shano bringing it over here to the near side, but squirting out of there is Medford. That is Tessman. Tessman a little give and go to herself. She's got a little bit of room, but now she'll slow it down. Leave that one off for Seidel. Seidel, a little bit of trouble here. Shauna will take it away. That one's going to come back over into the middle. Shauna trying to get that one around. It's going to be poke checked out. Guess that'd be using a hockey term there, but a little kick check as that one's going to bounce in towards goal. But then it gets sent off to the side, and Shauna will swing that one back out, and they will push forward for the moment, but Medford will get it right back. Medford trying to find the opening. Pass comes all the way through. She's on side kick in right to Brynlene, Brylin Boyle. Boyles, excuse me, the goalkeeper. Ball's going to come back the other way. That's going to go out. That's going to be a throw to Shano. Is going to leave the throw. They're going to send that one now for Caitlin Modi. Into the middle. That one's going to get knocked down. Push back here. Swing that one around now to the far side. That one's going to get poked away. Shyla Radlinger looking to attack. She's got options. Sends that one through a little too far, and that's going to go out the back for the goal kick. Right thought, she had Tessman attacking, but... Oh, it's not Tessman, excuse me. That was Bailey Metz 
on that near side attacking, but just could not quite connect with her as that one's going to go all the way out to midfield. Shauna will pick it up there. They're going to try and play it here along the near side. Building up, gets around the defender, tries to turn that one in. That ball's going to keep bouncing through. Raiders are going to push it over here to the near side. They can't quite get to it. It'll be out for a throw. Chance to set the defense. Shano converting quickly. As the Brewers lead 3-0. Jackson Churio, another home run. Twelve twelve gone by here. Still 0-0. Zero, zero. Thought about the three thought about one throw, didn't take it. Now takes another one. That one's gonna bounce around right near the line. That's gonna bounce through and back behind, and that's gonna be out for a goal kick. Thought maybe it might have taken a ricochet off of a raider, but both all the officials say no, so it's out for the goal kick. That one's gonna be swung through. Shauna will end up with it on that far side, trying to build up. That one's going to bounce around through, and that's going to go out the back for another goal kick. <laughs> that one's going to be sent out. Bouncing around through. That one's going to be tucked back in. Popped up into the air. Trying to, somebody trying to settle it. Let's come over here to the near side. Shano, can't quite do it. That one's going to pop through. Numbers for the Raiders. Metz, still with the ball, needs to find somebody. That one's going to pop sideways. Coming in, that's going to be collected up by Boyles. Make sure. Wanted to make sure Boyles was the keeper. She is. That one's going to come out here. Bouncing around through, still bouncing through. Swinging back around, Shano. They get forward quickly. So that one's going to be sent all the way back through. Chance, yo, oh, that one's going to bounce up. Raiders need to get back on side. Raiders slow it down for a second. Throw goes quickly the other way. That one poked away. Nice little move there by 14. That is Madeline Pied South. Madeline. But yeah, Raiders have had a good start to the year defensively. They've given up just the one goal. That was to Regis McDonald. Otherwise, they have held everybody else scoreless. Whistle, and we're going to get a handball, and that's going to be a free kick to the Raiders. Rice Lake was a 0-0 tie. Crandon, 7-0. The 1-0 loss to Regis McDonald, and then the 2-0 win against Amherst Iola Scandinavia back last Tuesday. One bouncing up into the air. Settle down. They're going to spin that one around. That is Tessman. Tessman. Lead out there. They're going to try and connect up. Oh, had a chance, but couldn't quite get past the defender. That's going to be guided out of play, and that's going to be out for a Medford throw. Medford will get the throw deep. Take a look at Shano on the other hand. They are 2-2 two and two on the year. Throw that one in the box. That one's going to come in off the post. Bounces around again. That time, Boyles gets down to it. Shano, a 4-2 loss at Rhinelander. So that one will be sent high into the air. 5-0 win at, against Mosinee. Then a 15-0 win over Green Bay West as Brunner will send that one high into the sky before losing last Thursday 2-0 at Seymour. So in a couple games, they were able to put some so put some goals in the back of the net. That 5-0 against Mozania, a good 
scale test for this Raider team against some conference opponents. Kind of see where you stack up, especially with Rhinelander coming up on Thursday up there. So that one's going to be sent out of play and out for a throw. Throw comes in. Knocked down. That's going to get knocked around. Pushed out. That's going to get pushed a little further out. Whistle. And it's going to be a free kick. Referee tried to play tried to play the advantage on that one, but it wasn't there, so they'll pull it back for the free kick. 17-16 gone by as we approach the midway point of the first half. Raiders pop that one up into the air, trying to connect up. They go over here for Mets. Mets, that one's going to get swung around. Again, Shano moves quickly forward. They are always looking to attack. That one comes through, but oh, can't quite connect together. Popped up into the air. That one will be kept in play. And that's going to go out for a corner. Probably would have been better off to let that one bounce out the back for the goal kick, but mental mistake there for the Raiders, and that will give Shano the corner. Fakes, tries to fake that one out. They take it short. Now looking to connect back up. Get that one into the middle. Chance here. Shot comes in. That's going to get knocked down. Another shot comes in. Raiders are going to push this one off to the side and try and spin this one forward. Nice little play there. The little pass doesn't quite connect. That's going to come all the way through. Shano will get it back. Shano again looking to attack from this near side. Swinging this one all the way down into the corner. Trying to send the cross through. Red jersey there. Bringing this one forward. It gets missed. That's going to go out for the throw. Shano throw. Caitlin Modi to take it. Sends that one into the middle. Madeline Mesh there. Swing that one around. That one's going to bounce around through, and that's going to be taken away. Raiders looking to attack. Swing that one around through. Shano picks it up. They'll try and turn that one back, but it's going to go out of play. That'll be out for a Raider throw. Throw comes in. Quick try to push forward. Good defense there. They're going to bring that one back. Nice little give there. Pushing forward. That one's going to come down. It's going to be sent sideways. That's going to go out for the throw. Defense collapsing in on that one. Medford will have the throw. Going to bring the right back. Petzl up to take it. Petzl trying to get that one into the middle. That one's going to bounce around a little bit. Medford will have it for the moment. Knocked away by Shano. Shano tries to cross up. This one's going to get ahead. Sent right back in by Medford. Leave that one off. Pass is going to come into the middle for Radlinger. Radlinger, the little give. Chase down. See who they can find from the side here. Bring that one back across into the middle. That one, oh, Shano gets to it first. Sends it clear for the moment. That one's going to come here out of play. That is going to be a throw to Shano. As we cross the midway point of the first half, 0-0. Zero, zero. Melon. Piatsawik. Piatsawik. I think I got that right. Apologize for the names, like I said. We got here about 10 minutes before the start of this one. So softball running long. Piaskowit. There we go. <laughs> that was going to bounce all the way through. Bouncing around. That chance there. Turning back quickly. Medford will recover. Medford trying to get this one through, but it's going to go out of play, and that's going to be out for a Shano throw. Ooh. 
Um, long time on the throw here, trying to get something set up. That one popping up. They're going to try overload this near side. Raiders not having it. Shut down quickly. That one's going to be fed through. Chance here if they can get to a first. Can't. That one's going to come all the way around and be kept in play. Raiders keep it moving, keep it on their end for the moment. Shauna will end up with it though, but can't get it past the defender. That one's going to be led forward. Raiders able to spin this one back around though. They were first to it. Cutting it back. Pass comes into the middle, but a little too far, and that's going to connect up with Shano. Shano bringing it back the other way. Cutting back up. That one's going to sneak through. Chance here now with numbers. Shot comes in just high. Over the bar for a goal kick. up with play here <laughs> throw in from the Raiders that one's going to be skied into the air down the field Radlinger if she can play it can't but Raiders get numbers forward as that's going to go out of play that's going to be out for a throw That one in the middle. Try and push that one. Shauna with it. It's poked away. Wrap that one around. Nice little play there to wrap that one around the Raider to get an opportunity. And that one's going to be sent out of play for a throw. Chance here for Shauna. 16 minutes remaining here in the half. That one's going to go out for another Shauna throw. A little further up. Baseball getting the win 14 nothing today as well. So, so far a good day for Raider sports. That one gets in the middle. That one's going to be tipped forward. Giving chase. Raiders will get to it first. Try and send that one across. Radlinger leaves that one over here to the near side, but it... It's a little bit away. Get that one back in the middle for Radlinger. Radlinger has it taken off her foot trying to set that one up. Shano bringing it back over here to the near side. That one's going to be guided out of play. That'll be a throw. So Medford will have the throw. Radlinger was trying to wind up a good swing. And now they'll bring Flegel up to take it. Get that one in the middle. They're going to cut that one back over here to the near side. That's going to be led a little too far, but it's going to have to be sent out. That one went out the back, so it's a corner. Raiders get a corner here. In a good spot. No, not. Check that. It is a throw. Thought for a second there, the ref said corner. Bouncing around through. That one's going to come back up. It's still... Ping-ponging around feet there. Raiders come away with it. Can't quite get the pass. Just whiffing on that one a little bit, and that's going to go out the back for a goal kick. Raiders putting the pressure on right now. That one's going to be swung through. Bouncing around. That's going to come back. Around over here to the near side. Swing it through. Knock down. Nobody there for the Raiders. Shano's, Shano will collect for the moment. Now that one's going to come back through. Medford trying to get this one forward. Just keeping it in play, but nobody there to recover. Good job there by Metz. They'll just keep that one in play. And now Shano has to push it out for the throw. Medford getting a little more confident moving forward. As we'll see Telesti come up to take the throw. Get that one in. That one's going to bounce back to Telesti. Telesti cutting back. A couple Raiders there, but Shano's able to come out with it. Shano pushing down this near side. They will bomb it downfield. And Raiders send it back the other way. 
Shano now attacking in a more traditional way, but it gets knocked away. Telusti able to push that one forward. Swing that one around. That's going to find Radlinger. Radlinger passes that one to the near side. Battle for it there. Raiders will come away with it. That one's going to be sent in. It's tucking in. Goal! Raiders tuck that one in. That is number 12. Megan Schaefer putting that one in the back of the net. Number 12, Megan Schaefer on the long goal. One nothing Raiders. I don't think that's what she was intending to do with it, but she just kind of kicked it towards net and it tucked in under the bar. And Raiders lead one nothing. And for the way the Raider defense has played, that is a very difficult hill, hill to climb for a lot of teams. So... 13, a little under 13 to go here in the first half. We'll see how Shano responds as this one's going to come down here to the near side as the camera goes out of focus for a second. That's going to go out of play. That's going to be a Medford throw. Before we get that, we're going to get a substitution. Two changes. Schaefer's going to come off. Clarkson will come back on. Along with number 10, Alexis Seidel. Seidel can't quite find that one off the throw, but she will try and get around that one. That one's going to be pushed over here to the near side. She will settle it, turn the corner. That one's going to roll a little too far, and that's going to go out the back for a goal kick. Tapping up the big swing. That one's going to spin over to the far side. Raiders pop that one up high into the air. Still nobody quite able to settle. Now Shauna will settle it down. Swing that one up here to midfield. Shauna working over here on the near side. That one they can't quite keep in play. That's going to be out for a Medford throw. Here to the near side. That one knocked back over the far side. Shano looking to try and get this one out, but they can't quite connect. That's going to go out for the throw. there. Shauna will send that one back into the middle. Knocked down there by Medford. Medford trying to lead a pass forward. Gets to Radlinger. Radlinger looks to turn that one over. They're going to try. Oh, can't quite get the pass on there. Ball still loose. That one's going to be knocked back out by Shauna. Shauna looking to counter. Bring that one up. That's going to be left behind. That one. Shauna now, now pushing. That one's going to swing back into the middle. Red jerseys there. They'll send that one back to the midfield. Shano will recover there. They'll try and build back up again on this near side. A little miss on the back heel, and that's going to go out for a Medford throw. Ten minutes to go here in the first half. Throw is going to come in. little battle here along the near side. That's going to be kept in play. Shano will end up with it. Shano looking to attack. Leave that one off. Now build up, but slowed down by Medford. That's going to swing around here. All the way through, lead it out. They'll see which way it goes around the corner. Flag, it'll be out for a goal kick. Brenner retrieves the goalie ball from behind the net. And that one will be swung through. Shano picks it up on that far side. Keep Keep attacking that far side. Now looking to swing this one back into the middle. That one's going to go a little too far. And out for another goal kick. Yeah, 
Wing that one out again on that far side. There we go. That's more the angle we were looking for. Get back to. This one. That one's going to be tipped away. That's going to swing back around through and be popped up into the air. Over to the far side. That's going to go out, and that's going to be a Shano throw. Shano will take the throw quickly. Get that one into the box. Loose ball there, and that's going to be chipped out. Now a chance here. Raiders can't quite get to the ball first, but they will recover. Swing that one around. Oh, just off the side of a leg. Whoa. Tripod moves, and now that's going to be led forward. Swing that one in, but oh, defender there. Defender read it well. That one's going to be pushed back over here to the near side. Kept in play by Seidel. Seidel will send that one up into the middle, but to a white jersey. That one's going to swing over far side. Building up. That one's going to come all the way around. And Shauna, ooh, slipped between the legs there, and that slowed down the attack a little bit, allowed the defense to kind of get back and get set. Whistle, and we're going to get a foul on that far side. So free kick for Shano in a interesting spot here. Probably not enough to try and take a shot directly at goal. Raiders will have a three-player line, three-player wall. See if they try and wrap it around up here around the D and try and send something. Nope, they're going to send it at goal right into the hands of Sophia Brunner. Brunner stepping up. She will give it a boot. High end over end punt. I don't know if it was actually spinning end over end. I couldn't see it all that well, but felt appropriate with how nice of a punt that was. That one thrown in. That's going to come all the way through and get just tipped out into the middle. That was a nice little touch there. Medford starting to run, move forward. Swing that one around. Oh, just off the back heel. Finding Madison Miller. Raiders recover. Raiders swing that one over to the far side, but only white and black to get there. Six and a half minutes to go here in the half. Nice little move there to keep possession. That one's going to get pushed forward. Raiders are going to send that one back in. Bouncing around. Still bouncing around, and Shano will come away with possession and just bomb that one downfield. And the Raiders will send that one back out. Shano swinging it around over here to the near side. That one's going to get knocked down. Ball loose, and the Raiders take it, take it away. Lead out. This one, Seidel racing. She will not save it. Great job there by Alexis Seidel to even make that one close. Five and a half to, five and a half to go here in the half. Boyles will take this one herself. Stepping up. Sending it downfield. That one's going to be headed up into the air. Shano will settle it for the moment. Medford takes it away. Medford looking to attack. They lead that one out for Radlinger. Radlinger passes it over here, but oh, just a little too far into the hands of Braylon. Really, Boyles, as Boyles will throw that one out quickly. The low pass, that one's going to tuck around the Raider. Shano will pick it up. Shano trying to feed that one through. It'll be knocked back. Now they'll try and feed over here to the near side, connect up with Kendall Nope. Try and feed through. Knocked away. Raiders giving chase. They won't get to it. That's going to be out for a throw. Looking, surveying the team. That one's going to get into the middle and bounce around. Raiders will come away with it for the moment. Now that one's going to spin through. Nice moves there. Lead that one up into the middle. Raiders looking to attack again. Pressure coming from behind. Gets rid of it just in time. This one might be onside. Shot comes in. It's knocked wide. And out for a goal kick. Got 
Got it. Perfect timing on that run to stay on side and get an opportunity just uh, just wrong side of the post. Swings the foot through that one. That one's going to be kept down by the Raiders for the moment. Shano will collect. Get that one into the middle. Pressure comes immediately. Nice cut back. This one coming back around. Shano building here. They'll get across midfield. Shano. Lead run. They're going to force this one through. It's going to be cut back. Knocked away. Still being knocked around. And the Raiders will guide that one out for a throw. Take the throw quickly. Gets into the middle. Cuts past one, one defender. Now tries to swing that one through. That's going to go. Oh, it's going to stay loose and be picked up by Brunner. Brunner brings it all the way out. And she'll put a foot through that one. Knocked down and kept in this end. And that'll be sent out the side for a throw. Comes in. Shano again able to build something up. They're going to send that one in. Body gets in the way. Somebody in red getting in the way of that shot, and that's going to be chipped out. Shano will re recover. 2.20 to go here in the half. Chance here for Shano to equalize. Sends the shot in. Bouncing shot right to Brunner. This, that one will be booted downfield. Bouncing ball is going to take a Raider bounce. For a second there, Shano able to recover. Now Medford sends that one in. Radlinger is onside. Radlinger sends the shot, but it sails high. And out the back. Couldn't settle that one. Had to take it first time, and that ball just had that spin on it, and it sailed high. Wasn't much else she could do with it. Might as well take a shot. Boyles. Sets it up in the middle of the O of Medford in the end zone as that one's going to be sent low. Bouncing around through, and that's going to go out for a Shano throw. Minute 20 remaining in the half. Long throw. That's going to just keep bouncing. Raiders slow it down and send it back the other way. Takes a Raider bounce. Cutting it back. Swinging that one around through. One Shano will end up with it. It's popping over to that far side. Knocked down, taken away by the Raiders. Medford trying to settle this one in. Tuck that one around. Tessman. Nice pass into the area, but that's going to be slowed down and taken away by Shano. Shano will send it out. Now Shano looking to attack. They've got... 35 seconds to try and build something and get a shot off. They're going to bomb it downfield. That one is going to be picked up, actually be let go and sent out by Brunner. Brenner not taking any chances there of letting that one get in as that one's going to be led downfield. Shano will keep it in play along that far side. Shano getting this one ahead, a chance for a cross, cutting it back, Nine. looking for opportunities. Nine. This one can't quite get past the defense. Raiders will pop that one out. See if they just take a shot at this one. They do. That one's going to be knocked down. And that will do it. The goal from Megan Schaefer gives the Raiders a 1-0 lead. We are going to step aside for the halftime. We'll be back with the second half right after this. You know that nearly three-quarters of teens feel uncertain about their personal finances? yet a whopping 73% have expressed a strong desire to learn more. At MMCCU, we're thrilled to announce our new partnership with Greenlight, a financial tool designed for kids and teens. Give your kids the confidence they need for a secure financial future. Enroll them in the Greenlight platform for free today. Enjoy features like parental controls, engaging educational tools, and a safe space for learning about saving, spending, and earning money. Empower your child with financial wisdom. Sign up for a free Greenlight well, that account. I can today. handle schooling my children because RVA provides the tools that I need. The RVA has adjusted curriculum by placing children right where their learning is. That's the number one goal is to make sure that your children are learning and so you don't move on if they're if they haven't grasped the concept you stop pause and you make sure that you grasp that before you move on. 
the RVA will work with your child's needs and will provide the support and the attention that your child not only needs, but deserves. Better begins with the way we see each other. Better begins with the way we treat each other. Better begins with the way we care for each other. Better begins at Aspira's help. Bringing out the better in all of us. I spluced my phone in the road crater? Am I covered or no? Well, hey Carm, you're never gonna believe this. A sturgeon just hit my Chevy. Am I covered or no? Interesting. And yes. Hey bud, I had a couple 30 packs explode in my garage. Am I covered or no? I've been there before, bud. It's a sad day. Oh, what a beautiful day. Oh, ever eat a brat and drive. Winter Insurance of Northern Wisconsin is your qualified, experienced team for custom insurance packages for your vehicle, your home, and your family. At Clinter Insurance, protecting your family is our top priority. Clinter Insurance. Are you ready for a faster and easier mortgage process? TAP Lending combines the speed and efficiency of technology and people and a great local bank. The perfect combination for your mortgage. years of working experience, the team at Century 21 Dairyland Realty are ready to help you. Whether you're looking for a new home, recreation land, or a place to start your new business, the team at Century 21 Dairyland Realty are ready to help you. Stop into either of their convenient locations on West Broadway Avenue in Medford or North 4th Street in Abbotsford or find them online at c21dairyland.com to find out more. Century 21 Dairyland Realty, a proud supporter of local athletics. Family Auto Group is now a full-line Western Factory Direct dealer with over 20 plows and accessories currently in stock. Whether it's a snow shovel for moving the light work or a 9-foot, 6-inch poly V-plow, Wheelers has got you covered. I absolutely feel that Tiger Lily is getting a great education with RVA. She is challenged and she's not bored. She enjoys her classwork. I love the teachers. The teachers are the best part. My teachers are very friendly and they're easy to reach out to when you need help with an assignment. The teachers are always there when you need help. What I love about RVA is the flexibility, first. But second is that Tiger Lily is so happy with this school, with her teachers, 
and with what she's learning. It's awesome. experience in the RVA has been wonderful. The teachers are extremely supportive and Simon really seems to enjoy it and is making friends and he's more socially active now than he was in a traditional school. Something I want other kids to know is that even though it seems like you're not going to make friends, you actually are. I like how the RVA provides a, an environment that more suited to my needs. Clinter Insurance, we know you want to protect your business. The Clinter Insurance team will help you choose the insurance package and plan that fits you and your business. At Clinter Insurance, protecting your business is our top priority. Insurance. Looking to harness the power of the sun and save on your energy costs? With Marshfield Medical Center Credit Union Solar Loan, you can go solar without the burden of paying interest on the full amount from the start. Here's how it works. Instead of financing everything up front, we disperse loans when requested by your solar installer. If you're waiting on your installer, you won't pay interest during the wait. By taking advantage of this flexible payment option, you could save on unnecessary interest charges. Visit mmccu.com solar to learn more today. Nat over at Wheeler Chevrolet GMC and I am standing in our all new express lane open now no appointment necessary stop on in and get things like oil changes filters quick lubes no appointment necessary see you soon at Clinter Insurance we know you want to protect your business the Clinter Insurance team will help you choose the insurance package and plan that fits you and your business at Clinter Insurance protecting your business is our top priority You know that nearly three quarters of teens feel uncertain about their personal finances, yet a whopping 73% have expressed a strong desire to learn more. At MNCCU, we're thrilled to announce our new partnership with Greenlight, a financial tool designed for kids and teens. Give your kids the confidence they need for a secure financial future. Enroll them in the Greenlight platform for free today. Enjoy features like parental controls, engaging educational tools, and a safe space for learning about saving, spending, and earning money. Empower your child with financial wisdom. Sign up for a free Greenlight I account that I today. Can handle... Welcome back. We head to the second half. Raiders lead 1-0 on a goal by Megan Schaefer, we believe. 
I'm 80% sure it was Megan. This one's going to swing around here. Shano kicks off here to start the second half. We'll see if the Raiders stay packing even a little more defensively or if they try and find that second goal. Or maybe a little of both as that one's going to swing around far side. Raiders have it trying to find an opening. That one's going to get poked. Sent back in, rolling down. That's going to cross is going to come in. That's going to hit a red body in red. And an early corner here for Shano. Shano, you want that goal back early. Back. Big swing through. That one's going to be low, and a red Raider is going to pick that one up and bring it out of the. No, can't quite get it out of the area. Now that one's going to swing back in again, but that's going to go well out the back and out for a th out for a goal kick. Swing it over here to the near side. That one's going to take a fortuitous Medford bounce. Now that one's going to come back around. Shauna will keep it in play. Actually an advantage to the Raiders. Raiders will swing that one up. That's going to break off of a head. Tessman will settle it in the middle. That one's going to swing back around. Out in front. Heads it forward. Chance here. Ball still heading in towards the penalty area. That one's going to be swung back around. That's going to roll out the back and be out for a goal kick. Losing power there for a second. There we go. Get that back. Catch all the way up. Figure out where the action is here. Throw comes in. High throw. That's going to come into the middle. Bouncing around through. That one's going to be swung back. Shano. Flipping everything through. That's going to be cleared all the way back out. Picked up there. Radlinger can't quite get around the defender. Defender sends it back clear. That's going to be picked up right down in front of us. Swing that one back around. Pressure comes back. That's going to push this one the other way. Swing that one back around. That one's going to squirt through everybody. Battle for it there. That's going to be out. That's going to be last touched by Shano. Clarkson to pick it up. She'll, she'll handle the throw. No, she will not. Leaves that one behind. They will bring Petzl up to take the throw. Send that one in. Clarkson trying to settle that one down. Can't quite. That's going to swing back around. Over here to the near side. Tucking that one around. And that one's going to be pushed forward. All the way down. That's going to be led through. Little battle for it along the near side. Trying to turn the corner. That instead is going to go out for a Shano throw. Shano gets the throw here. So, whoa. Bumping the tripod there. That one's going to get headed around a couple times. Paul loose here in the near side. That one's going to get wrapped back around. They're going to try and send that one clear. They do. And now a chance here for... Medford to counter. That one's going to take a bounce. That's going to roll all the way over to the far side. That's going to be sent downfield. Winning the race. Raiders will pick it up on that far side. See what avenues they have. They'll play that one back. Bringing that one across. They're going to cross field over here to the near side. That one gets through. Cutting it back. Chance here. Gets knocked away. Shano trying to find an avenue out. They do. Spin this one around. Raiders will keep it in, though. Again, Shano trying to spin through, and that one's going to get poked out, and that's going to be out for a Shano throw. Approaching the end, approaching the five-minute mark here of the second half. Forty-five minutes into this one, so that one's going to pop up, bounce around. They're going to say it was out of play, and it's going to be a Shano throw. Throw into the middle. Somebody wasn't, I don't think somebody was quite ready for that one. That's going to be sent out by the Raiders. 
Swing that one around. Nice little move there. Raiders looking to attack. They're going to send that one along that far side. Swing through. Raiders will pick it up near there, and they're going to have to just... That's just going to be sent out. Shano getting a foot to it. Raider throw. Throw comes in. Settled down. That one's going to be passed back. Now that one's sent through right to the feet of Boyles. And she will pick it up for the goal kick. Or not the goal kick. Just putting it back in play of the punt. She'll punt this one deep. Bouncing all the way through. This one, a great conversion over the field. Looking to build on that far side. That's going to get knocked down, but it's going to go out the back, and that's going to be a corner. Another Shano corner. Shano takes a long time to set up these their set pieces, both throws, free kicks, and corners. Possibly trying to shorten the game. That one comes around. That's going to get knocked down. That's going to go be kept in play for the moment. Now it's going to roll to back another corner. This one they set up a little quicker. Stepping up. They got a run heading in towards the box. That one's going to be played by Brunner. Brunner picks it off. She'll set up, and she will send that one into the night sky. Using the, using the bounce of the turf as that one settles down here. Cutting that one back, but Raiders right there to send that one back out to midfield. Picked up there by Shano. Shano cuts that one back. Sends it along that far side, but it's going to be sent back out by Medford. Medford, lead pass. Got Radlinger if she can cut it back. Got to be careful now. Radlinger stays on side. Radlinger can't quite settle it. That one's going to come back in for Radlinger. Shot goes in. That's going to be just wide. Set up perfectly for Radlinger in the middle. It just spins away on her a little bit. Another one where the defense was collapsing in. She had to take it one, take it on the first touch. But a good set, good build up and a good setup there for the Raiders. Goes out for the goal kick. The low line drive. That's going to bounce through everybody. Raiders will send that one right back in. Headed out. Raiders flip that one into the middle. That one's going to bounce back around. Trying to get something. That's going to come out here. Raiders will send it right back in. Raiders looking to build an attack here quickly. Cutting it back, an opportunity. Looking for the pass, get that one into the middle. That one's going to get popped away. That one's going to get chipped towards the net right to Boyles. She will collect that one up. Quick conversation between Boyles and one of her defenders. She sends that one into the night sky. Clouds starting to build in. Tomorrow's going to be a very different day. Uh, baseball, soccer, doubleheader for us tomorrow. Baseball, we will be in out at Raider Field. The Columbus Catholic Dons come in. That was supposed to be a doubleheader down in Rapids back in the first week of April. That got postponed due to Columbus's deep playoff run for basketball. I mean, they did win the state championship. And then... Uh, got rescheduled for tomorrow, so we will have that one for you. Then we will be up here as soon as we can for Northland Pines coming into town to take on the Raiders. That will be at 7 o'clock. Swing that one through. That's going to be knocked down. Battle for it here. Popped high up into the air. That one's going to bounce and go out of play, and that's going to be out for a Raider. For, excuse me, a Shano throw. That one's going to be swung back out. Out for a Raider throw. Raider 
just get the throw in quickly. Chip that one forward, but that's not going to be handled. That's going to be out for a Shano throw. Under half an hour to play. Shano looking for the equalizer here before they can do the throw. We get his change. Haven't been many changes here tonight. It's been a pretty quick game. In terms of that, both teams playing pretty much. I mean, a couple, I mean, a bunch of players on both teams have played the entire, entire 50 minutes so far. This one taken away. A little bit more in game shape here now. Swinging this one back around, cutting it back. Taking the shot. That's going to go wide. Out into the high jump area and to the fence. And that will be a throw for, or excuse me, a goal kick. That one off the side of the foot. That is going to be settled down, but didn't quite get it nearly as far as I think they wanted to. Taken away. Still loose. Shano trying to work this one forward. That's going to be tucked back around. Nice little tuck around the attacker for Shano. Pressure coming from behind. That's going to be sent back in. Nobody there, though. Seidel will get that one into the middle. Getting past the defender. Chipping that one forward. That one's going to take, oh, that's going to take a Shano bounce. That one bounces off the other side of the foot. That might end up now. Raiders, and that's going to be a foul. The push from behind, that'll be a foul. Free kick to Medford. See what Medford draws up from this. Sending the low burner, but that's going to be picked up by Shano. Shano will play this one out. Shano trying to build up. Medford slows it down, sends it back the other way. Picked up on that far side, chipping that one high up into the air. Gets over the top of the Medford attacker. Able to settle it for the moment, knocked away. Medford turning the corner. That one's going to be battled for. Turning that one around. They're going to bring that one back up into the middle. Looking at her options, sending that one through, looking for Rattlinger was just a little wide. And Shauna will send that one out along that far side. That's going to roll all the way out for a Medford throw. Throw comes in. That's going to be sent in. Shauna can't quite settle it. That one still can't quite be settled. Now finally, and now... Looking for the handball there. They're not going to get the call, and that's going to go out the side for a Medford throw. Throw in. Settling that one down. Turning that one around. Medford. That one kind of tucking under the foot. And that one, oh, nice look, but just could not quite connect. That one's going to be headed forward, and that's going to go out of play. That's going to be a throw for Shano. Throw that one long downfield. This is actually good practice for the Raiders. Oh, that one's going to be a foul. A little bit of a collision there. Nothing intentional. Setting up. Swinging that one in. Low line drive again. That's going to be knocked down by the Raiders. And now Medford looking to attack. That one is going to bounce around a little bit. Medford swinging that one out to the far side. Trying to connect up. Got a chance here. Got Radlinger with her. Radlinger needs to come back on side. Now they send that one in. Radlinger, and she's offside. Didn't quite get back on side in time. Good call by the official. She was definitely about a yard offside. It's the downside of the of the football lines, I think, more than anything, is that it helps the I guess technically, I guess you could say a good a good thing, but also a bad thing if you're the player that gets called for it. It helps the Line judges line up who's where when you've got somebody on one side of a hash mark, somebody on the other side. That one's going to get through. That one is on side. Knocked away. Still a chance here. Knocked around some more, and that is going to be turned around, trying to get this one out. 
They're going to say play on, and that one's going to get pushed out. We'll see now if they... It's going to be... He attempted to play an advantage. Now it's going to be a Medford free kick just outside the penalty area. So he played the advantage, and then when the advantage was lost, called it back. Seen him do this a couple times now. So Medford's going to have a kick just outside the penalty area, and I'm not 100% sure that wasn't in. Right, uh, It was right on the line, so it could go either way, and I think as a high school official, you're going to give the benefit to the free kick, but... Opportunity here, Tessman lines this one out. Two-player wall here from Shano. She will take the kick in. That one goes just over the bar. And out for the goal kick. Right thought from Tessman. If that one sucks down just a little bit more on the spin, that she probably puts that one away. Saw her do it against Pines last year from a very a little further out than that, but... Boyles will just pass out the goal kick. And now they'll send that one downfield. Knocked down by the Raiders. Tuck that one back around through. Ball bouncing along. Giving chase. That one's going to be forced out of bounds. They will say Shawno. Twenty-four twenty remaining. As we track down a ball. And now we'll get a substitution. Delayed substitution, and that allows more time to run. Throw is going to be sent downfield. That one's going to bounce around through everybody as we catch up to it. That's going to be guided. That's going to go out of play, and that's going to be out for a goal kick. Oh, as the second ball comes back into play. Get tucked around the side of the net. As the line drive will come down, it'll be played by Shano initially. Medford will try to settle it. That one's still bouncing around. Shano will end up with it. Passes it forward. Medford gets it back. That one's still loose. Medford trying to clear this one out. Now it'll get forward. Pressure comes here. That's going to slow down. Send that one ahead. It's going to go a little too far. Shano will pick it up. Shano working that one back into the middle. Battle along here in the middle. That one's going to come back around far side. Looking to build. That one's going to come back in. Back around. That's going to get tucked over here to the near side. Medford will come away with it. Chip that one forward. Radlinger able to save that one. Sends that one out. That one's going to be sent along the ground. Foot race to the ball. Boyle does not come out for this one. Thought maybe she might. That one's going to get poked away a little. Thought she had more time. Didn't realize that, that one's going to come off. That's going to spin out of play, and that's going to be a Shano throw. Took an interesting spin off the turf down there. 58-53 gone by. One comes into the middle. That one's going to get knocked down. It's going to push forward. Chance here. That one's going to get ticked. Chucked up. Radlinger, a chance. Thou couldn't quite get a good swing on it. That ball is kind of bouncing. She just directed it towards goal. You know, you never know. Send it that way. But she couldn't get a full swing on that one as that ball was kind of bouncing around on her as that's going to go out for a Medford throw. Right thought, though. Give it that little tap. You never know. It takes an odd bounce. Especially on the turf. So that's going to go out for a Shano throw. Raiders, you'd love that insurance goal here. Get that lead. Give yourself some breathing room. You can take not necessarily a few more chances defensively, but you feel more comfortable packing in defensively a little bit more. As that's going to go out, that's going to be a Medford throw. Medford getting that one in. 
A couple defenders wrap around. That's going to come back around through. It's going to get knocked away. Shauna will send it back out to the midfield. She doesn't get to try to send it back out to the midfield. That one's going to come back around. Looking, cutting back. Ball, that's going to be tip, chip forward. Chase given, but that's going to be out for a Medford throw. So Medford will get a throw about 15 yards from the end line. As we cross the hour mark, one nothing. Shano's, that one's going to bounce around. That's going to go out the back. That's going to be a corner. So Medford will get a corner here. See what Medford draws up. Schaefer steps up the low line drive. That's going to come all the way out of the penalty area, and that one's going to bounce around through, and Shano's going to clear it. Right thought. The bodies were there, just couldn't quite connect with them, and now Shano looking to counter. They're going to try and send that one along the far side. A little bit of a whiff turf monster coming up. And now that one's going to be chipped forward, but that's going to go a little wide, and that's going to be out for a Shano throw. Throw comes in. Looks to turn the corner. That one's going to be pushed forward. Chip back along. And Shano's going to build the attack now. Shano. Coming up. That one's going to build. But Medford's going to get to it first. They're going to let this one go out the back. Goal kick. Approaching 18 minutes. That clock kick clicking, ticking about as slowly as you could expect at this point. If you're a Raider fan, at least, that clock is really ticking slow. If it's a, if you are a Shano fan, it is ticking quickly. Picked up here along the near side. Throw comes in. That one's going to get knocked down. Building up. That one's going to get pushed away, giving chase. Shano able to... Nope. Well, oh, they slow that one down, and it is a throw. Couldn't quite keep it in play. And Medford will take a long time on the throw. Before that, we get substitutions. Throw comes in. That one's going to take a Raider bounce. It's going to... Play forward, Shauna will collect, try and do something with it. They can't quite. Trying to find options. Chip that one forward. Giving chase, they're slowing down a bit. That one's gonna be won by Shauna for a moment. Now that one's gonna come back into the middle, but a little wide of Radlinger, and that one's gonna be Shauna looking to build back the other way, but knocked away by Medford. Medford passes that one over here to the near side, swings that one around through. That's gonna get sent back out towards the far side. That is going to be go out for a throw. And we will get another change for the Raiders. 16 and a half to play. That clock ticking down. Medford more than happy to spend some time taking some throws. As that one's going to be tucked back around. That's going to go out for another Medford throw. Throw comes in, and it's a throw violation. Sean will throw. 16 minutes to play. Headed up into the air. Settling. Turns. That one's going to go out. Medford throw again. Toss in. Medford, maybe now the chance, but I can't quite connect on the pass. Looking to push this one out is Shano. That one's going to be knocked away. Pass led out, but that's going to be a little too far and out for a Shano throw. As we're just playing the throw in game on that far side right now, neither team really able to keep the ball in play. It's that one fought for. 
Shano has it for the moment, trying to turn the corner against a Raider defender, does. That one's going to push forward for the moment, knock down for a second, but Shano will recollect. Shano starting to build something here. Shano pushing down that far side, tucks that one in. That's going to be sent back out. That's going to ricochet around, and that's going to go out the back for a goal kick. Brunner will take it herself this time. Brenner over here to the near side. That one's going to be cut back inside. A little battle for it there. A little lean by Schaefer. Coming back across. That one's going to be poked away. Pushed out for the moment. Pincer movement gets Shano back the ball. They're going to send that one back, try and reset. Looking for options. Gets past the first defender. Cuts that one in. That's going to roll right to Sophia Brenner. 13 to play, or excuse me, 14 to play. Swing that one out. That's going to bounce around. Shauna will end up with it. Taken away by Medford. Medford swings that one out across midfield. Settling it down. That one coming forward. That's going to go a little too far on, on Rad, for Radlinger. Recollected back up by Medford. Medford chips it along that far side. That's going to be taken away by Shauna. Shauna will send that one downfield. That's going to roll all the way through. It's going to stay in bounds. Medford will have to play it. And Medford will let that one go out for the throw. Tuck this one in. Medford is booting that one clear for the moment. Sending that one along that far side. Shauna will get to it first. Shauna back up here. This one's going to wrap around. Chance here. That one's going to bounce around a little bit. And Medford will just send that one to the far side. Medford continuing the pressure. That one trying to find the corner turn. Does. Shano trying to build this one back up. They'll give the short pass. That one's going to be swung back out far side. Gives defense a chance to recover. Back in towards the numbers. Gets past the first defender. Medford there, though, to slow that one down. But it's going to take a Shano bounce. Shano into the middle. That's going to be sent back out into the night sky. And that's going to go out the side for a Shano throw. So Shano will be able to set up the throw. As we approach 12 minutes remaining. Long time for Shano. Don't have to get too desperate just yet. But also can't be complacent as that one's going to get sent out. That's going to be another Shano throw. can't like still try and play you got to put some pressure on but you don't have to necessarily put all the pressure on you just yet so that one's going to swing through bounce through and that's going to be collected up oh there we go catch up by Brunner Brunner the low line drive that's going to take a Shano bounce first and another Shano bounce off the kick that one's going to be sent in Brunner is there This one goes high into the air. Not quite as long. Takes a Medford bounce. Then a Shano bounce as it has still loose. Collected up. And now the Raiders are going to bring it up here along the near side. Tuck that one inside. 11 minutes to play. Bouncing that one around. That's going to go out. And that's going to be Medford. They're going to say it was last touch by Shano. So it's going to be a Medford throw. Change for the Raiders here. Trying to get everybody on before the last five minutes. You don't have to stop the clock. That throw is going to come through. Trying to find an opening. That one's going to bounce around. Still bouncing around. That one passed through. Shot goes up. And it's going to be come down short. And collected up by Boyles. Sometimes hard to tell where those are. Especially on that end, because I can't see very well from our vantage point. This one's going to keep rolling. Shano cannot quite connect up on it. It's going to be out for a Medford throw. As we have 10 minutes remaining. 
toss comes in. That one's going to get headed right back here, and it's going to be popped high up into the air. Takes a bounce. Shauna will try and settle. Now Medford will get it settled down. Medford, chance here. They got Radlinger. Lead pass for her. Out a little wide. Chance comes in the other way. It's going to be guided around into the corner. Shauna will pick it up from there. Shauna needs to get this one forward. That's instead going to be slowed down, and they're going to have to throw it in. Seventy forty one gone by. Shano. Now's the point where you gotta start sending everybody forward. But instead, you gotta be careful, you know, send most everybody forward. Still keep some players back. But I think you're not really gonna you really wanna have winning one nil winning winning one nil, winning two nil really isn't gonna make much of a difference at this point. This isn't a conference game, so you're not gonna, you know, maybe be tied on goal difference. Maybe a seeding question, but not anything that's going to be super crucial at this point. But the difference between a draw and a tie is a big difference if you are Shano or for Medford, a win and a tie. Win and a draw. Eight and a half to play. Throw came in. That one's going to be let out. Shano's going to guide that one out of play. They'll get the throw. That one chipped forward. Nice little nice little cheeky move there, but that one's going to come back. Now a chance here. That little chip, it wasn't, wasn't real obvious, but popped it past the defender. Medford able to recover on that one, though, as that one's going to be popped back out for the moment. Medford swings it over here to the near side. Probably would have been better to let that one go, but now Shano, maybe a chance here. Ball giving chase. That one is going to be let to go out the back, and that will be a goal kick. Under eight to play. Brunner is going to take it all the way to the other side. Run as much clock as she can. Take her time setting this one up. All those little things that you do as that one's going to come right out for Shano. That one's going to come all the way back in. It'll be played by Medford. Medford trying to turn this one out. That's going to be slowed down for a moment. Medford able to recover, though, and they're going to get this one back. Pushing down the sideline. That one's going to be tucked around, and that's going to be out for a Medford throw. More chance to run clock. Seidel's going to come up to take it. Or excuse me, that's Petzl up to take it. Turning that one around, trying to get past. It's going to spun, spun back around. Shano looking to attack. Didn't see where it was, and that's going to be sent downfield. Bouncing around. Shano will send it back across, across the midfield stripe. Shano trying to build something up. That's going to be sent high into the night sky. Bouncing around. That's going to take a Medford bounce. Another Medford bounce. That's not going to be able to be kept in, and that's going to be a throw to Medford. No, they're going to say throw it. To... Oh, they're going to say it was a free kick. Never mind. Free kick, maybe offside. So that one's going to swing through. Knocked down by the Raiders. Medford setting this one up, setting that one down for Radlinger. It's going to take a bounce off of her. Shauna will collect. They're going to try and turn this one around. Six to play. One, two, takes, ends up being a Raider bounce as that one's going to be led through. Shano will recollect. That's going to spin around, and that's going to be out for a Shano throw. Shano takes the throw quickly. Chipped over the head of the attacker. And Medford back in possession, looking to push this one downfield. Lead that one out. That one's going to be chipped back through. Flag is up. Radlinger was offside. Again, right call. Radlinger just didn't get back onside in time, and it's going to be a free kick, but that does run clock as we approach five minutes remaining. See if Shano just bombs this one deep. Or nope, they are going to chip it over to this near side. 
Nothing doing there. Misdirected. That one's going to get knocked down. Radlinger will keep it. That's going to spin over here to the near side. Chip forward. A little too far. Shauna will end up with it. That's going to be resettled by Medford. Now a whistle. That's going to be a handball. We're going to get that one on Clarkson. Ref saying she brought the hand up and then caught it with the elbow. So four and a half to play. Shano sending that one low. It's going to be knocked down by Medford. Drace to the ball. That one's going to come through, and Shano will push it back out. But Medford, that one's going to take a bounce. Rolls slowly to the far side. That's going to be out for, should be a Medford throw. And we're going to get a quick change. They don't stop the clock. Should have. Ref never putting the cross up to stop it. That one coming up. We're going to get a whistle, and that's going to be another foul on the Raiders. Shauna will get the free kick. Under four to play. Medford doing a great job here keeping the ball on this end of the field. Again, another low burner. It's going to go right to a Raider. Raiders building up here. Sending that one through. Got a little too far for Radlinger, just barely, almost got to it. Raiders will keep this one down. They're going to send that one up. That's going to go right to Boyles. Boyles will collect. 3.15 to play. That one is going to go short. Raiders are going to push it right back down their way. Pressure comes. Can't quite cross that one in. Ball still there. Raiders are going to push it along that backside, and that's going to roll out the back, and that's... Going to be a corner. They're going to say that's a Raider corner. So now a chance for the Raiders to run clock here, under three to play. See if they try and score, or if they just bring it down into the corner and try and run clock. Schaefer will come over to take it. Nobody else really with her right now. She'll swing this one in low. That one's going to bounce all the way through. Shot comes in, bouncing. That's going to be cleared off. Cleared off the line. Raiders are going to head down for that one. Try and slow this one down. Tuck that one through. Around over on that far side. Nobody really pressuring. Now they get a little bit. Play it back. Back over here into the middle. Chip that one over. Shot. That's going to be blocked. Now a chance here for Shano. Shano sprinting downfield. That one's going to come all the way through. That is going to be... Bouncing around through. Chance here for Shano. Serious chance. That one's going to come in and be played by Brunner. Under two to play. And Brunner just boots that one downfield. That's going to go through everybody. Radlinger will settle. Always easy to tell Radlinger. She's the taller one with the teal shoes. That one's going to bound downfield. Shano will collect. Minute and a half to play. Swing this one back around to the far side. That's going to go out of play. It's going to be a Medford throw. Medford will take their time. Short throw. That's going to bounce back up here in the middle. They're going to chip that one downfield. Down towards the corner. Being led downfield. Raiders will let that one go out the side for a throw. One minute remaining. So a little more on Medford playing the wasting game as long as the referee would let them. Changing over as that one's going to go out the side. That's going to be another Medford throw. Forty Under 40 seconds to play. Throw comes in. Medford brings that one down into the corner. Medford keeping that one tied up in the corner under 30 to play. Medford passes this one back out. Swings it over here to the near side. Trying to get to it first. It's going to get knocked away for the moment. That one's going to get sent over here to the near side. 12 seconds. Shano needs to get this one in quickly. That one's going to be sent sky high, and that'll do it. Medford is going to get another win. 
one. One nothing. They still have only given up one goal this season. And another another clean sheet for the Raider, Raider defense. We're going to be down on the field, and we are going to talk to our goal scorer. We believe that's Megan Schaefer. We'll verify that. But make sure to make sure to stick around for that. Coming up here in just a moment. Please travel safely on your way home. Check, check. Joined by our Century 21 Relentless Player of the Game and the lone goal scorer of the night, Megan Schaefer. Megan, kind of talk through that one. Long distance shot for you, tucked under the bar. What was what, what did you kind of see there? I just, everyone was telling me to shoot, and I just didn't have the right footing, but I just shot it, and somehow the goalie missed it. It was pretty cool. You know, and then obviously, you know, a one nothing lead for you guys seems to be almost insurmountable the way you guys have been playing defense. Is that kind of the confidence you guys have as well, that if you can get one goal, you guys are probably going to win? Yeah, I think as long as we, we just keep getting the first goal and coming out strong, I think we got a good season ahead. And then obviously, you know, 
the offense, you know, there, but defensively, you guys really didn't give Shano any serious opportunities. Again, you've still only given up the one goal all year. What'd you see from the defense? The defense this year is just doing so amazing. I mean, Talon and Maceda, the centers, they're really good. At, if one goes up, one drops back, and they both can boot it out, and it's it's really good. Everyone's hustling. It's it's pretty fun. You know, and then obviously now conference play starts tomorrow with Northland Pines before the trip to Rhinelander. What do you take from tonight into that? I think we just needed this win to help us give us a push to beat Pines tomorrow. I'm just really excited. I feel like we're going to do good. All right, sounds good. Congrats on the win. Go enjoy it with your teammates. Our Century 21 Relentless Player of the Game, Megan Schaefer. Thank you. Thank you. That's going to wrap things up for us today. We are back out here tomorrow night. We might be a little late on the start again with baseball starting at 5 if they play it. That's still a TBD. Um, but baseball at 5, that's Columbus Catholic here against Medford. And then soccer at 7 or shortly thereafter. So make sure to tune in for all of that. I'm Steve Ockenick, Sports on Focus. Enjoy the rest of your evening. We will most likely see you back out here tomorrow.